Are you okay? He said, I don't dare, this man is dangerous. This man, no. Not talking to me. <laughs> no, 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 Oh God, no, 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 it's very dangerous. He will put every, whatever on the table. I will not put up my hand. Yeah, okay. You didn't know that I was hearing from you. <laughs> my name is John from Ghana. What man of God is saying? 100% true. I was, hey, man of God is coming to ask me so many questions. People will see me. <laughs> it's true, man of God. You thought I was not hearing you talking. <laughs> <laughs> Very surprised. The silent listener. Very of every conversation <laughs> is Jesus. <laughs> Don't know what I'll say. He fears me to say any word. Ah, 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 Pastor, no, 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 for me, no. <laughs> 9 15 of 1 Samuel. Now the Lord told Samuel in his ear, mm -hmm. the day before Saul came, saying, mm -hmm. Tomorrow, about this time, mm -hmm. I'll send you a man from the land of Benjamin, mm -hmm. and you shall anoint him. Commander over my people Israel, that he might save my people from the hand of the Philistines. For I have looked upon my people because their cry has come to me. 17. So when Samuel saw Saul, the Lord said to him, There he is, the man of whom I spoke to you. This one shall reign over my people. Then Saul drew near to Samuel in the gate and said, Please. Tell me where is the seer's house. Mm -hmm. Samuel answered Saul and said, I am the seer. Go up before me to the high place, for you shall eat with me today, and tomorrow I'll let you go and will tell you all that is in your heart. Verse 20. But as for your donkeys that were lost three days ago, do not be anxious about them, for they have been found. So, whatever you are looking for, they have been found. The question is, did you meet the seer? 